Well, Kentucky's only craft beer festival gearing up now for its sixth annual event coming up this Saturday, June 24th at Waterfront Park. We are in the Charlie Wilson KitchenAid kitchen with a preview of everything you can enjoy at this year's Craft Bash. Joined by Katie Mollick with the Kentucky Guild of Brewers, Spencer Guy with Atrium Brewery, and Chef Ashley of uh, Northington with Happy Belly Food Truck already cooking up something for us, yes, right? Yes, I am. I got it going for you. I love it. <laughs> and, and I know, I mean, Katie, you guys are so busy planning like things for this this big event this Saturday. Uh, congratulations on what six years hopefully six, six years. Six yes. years. So how is the transformation of Waterfront Park going to happen? So it's amazing. It turns into the largest tap room in Kentucky. Crazy. We draw in breweries from all four corners of Kentucky. So you're going to get to try things that maybe you normally wouldn't. Uh, in Louisville or Lexington, it really brings out uh, the smaller tap rooms across Kentucky. So you're really going to get to try things maybe you normally wouldn't. All right. in one place. Right. And, and we're talking a lot. Like, what's the number on how many Ooh, I don't know. I lost how count, many but beers? it's definitely over 100. Over 50 oh breweries gosh. are part of the Kentucky Guild. Uh, yeah, that's wonderful. Yeah, so over 100 different brews, ciders, <laughs> sake, uh, all kinds of great stuff. Uh, what is new this year that you're excited to showcase mm. to everybody there on the waterfront? It's like, okay, I know if you went the previous six years, but this year there is something different. Yeah, we have our the usual suspects. We're going to have the woman in beer tent, but new this year also we have a couple local vendors. So Home Skate Shop's going to be there showing off their skateboarding skills. Uh -huh. We have Flying Axes uh, and a few other people like the Freezer History Museum. And also we invited our friends from J-Town Beer Fest to be a part oh, of it as fine. well. Yeah, we're going to catch up with awesome. them actually uh, in a couple weeks here too. You know, you're with the Guild of Brewers, and, and we talk so much in Kentucky about bourbon. What do you see as kind of the brewery scene here in Kentucky? And, it, you know, from your perspective, how it's just really grown? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, bourbon obviously is, is a homegrown thing, but so is the craft beer. I'd say it's just as on par as bourbon. Yeah. Plus, we complement each other. So a lot of craft breweries will use bourbon uh, materials in their beer. So we all know the bourbon barrel-aged beer, but also they're just they're friends, and we all get along, and it's great. But I'd say it's just as on par as bourbon. All right. And you can drink more than one, so. Oh, right. competition today, <laughs> right? Yeah. yeah. All right, Spencer, you're with Atrium Brewer. You brought a sample of what you're going to have there. Yeah. Um, and I mean, it's great. You guys are local. It's mm -hmm. great to, like, see you all back there. Like, mm -hmm. what does this kind of a festival do for, for you and getting your name out? Well, first of all, it's, it's about the people and seeing all of our friends and peers in the industry statewide and seeing everyone come in one place. And we have just as much fun sharing each other's beers as you have come and tasting Aww, everyone's yeah, beers. Um, so that's always just great. And just to see all the, all the faces and, and taste what everyone's been working on is, is just a really good time for, for us as yeah. brewers. So what are you bringing? What did you bring in here today? Uh, we're pouring uh, we're pouring a bunch of stuff at the Craft Bash. Uh -huh. uh, some some beers that taste like beer that are classic and crisp, and some beers that may bring you outside the box if maybe you think you don't love beer. Um, we're going to be pouring our breakfast crumble boys. So this is a sour oh. beer with peach, blueberry, maple, and coffee. Um, so this is like walking into a Denny's in a, in a, in a can. <laughs> you brought that for us because you knew it would be okay for us to drink that. Exactly. At this Any hour. excuse that I can give exactly. you to enjoy a beer. Uh, Exactly. We're pouring our Tropical Goza, that's uh, tangerine, passion fruit, guava, and a bit of pink salt, light tart fruit beer. Uh, we're pouring our West Coast Pilsner, super classic Pils taste uh -huh. with a big uh, American dry hop. Um, and the, the Pilsner is actually going to be poured at the Women in Beer Tent. Uh, they're doing a time tapping with that one at 4 o'clock. Oh, nice. um, so, yeah, we've got a little bit, a little bit something for everyone. You certainly yeah. do. Um, and, and, I mean, your business, obviously, Asian Brewery here in the Louisville area, mm -hmm. what, how, how has your business, like, grown, would you say, over the past even, like, two years? It's, it's been really incredible the support that we've gotten from our community uh -huh. and um, the words and faces we see people in the tap room and people uh, seeking us out from out of state even see, has, yeah. has been really uh, incredible. It is, the growth has been hard to keep up with and hard to manage, um, but uh, we're settling into a, to a great place and we're just so thankful for the, the support we get. That was an get. excellent quote, by the way. <laughs> it's hard to, that's great news, you know, and it, it shows that how the, how the country is kind of embracing what you're doing. Chef Ashley is with Happy Belly making up a, a sample of, you're going to be yes, there yes, uh, with correct. the food truck. Yes. So there's food there too after you down all this beer and you try yeah, things. It's very important. Um, it is. Balance. <laughs> balance. Balance. But I feel like, again, it kind of leans into what Spencer was saying, that there's something for everybody there, right? Correct. You can try yes. a little bit of the beers if you want, you know, and then sample some of the food. Right. Uh, what are some of the items that you're going to have Absolutely. that you're serving will, I will be selling an all-American burger and a barbecue bacon burger, um, and we'll have a couple of other options, uh, but we want to highlight the burgers today. Um, we'll be rolling a Louisville Restaurant Burger Week as well, so I want to kind of put oh, that on everybody's too, yeah. radar. Yeah. yeah. 
You're doing everything. Okay, yeah. you, we, we've got this beautiful top view uh, video right now. Oh, yeah. it's just about done. So it's the seven ounce patty with American cheese here. Oh, look at that. I got some leafy greens. Uh-huh. This is just a traditional burger that, you know, everybody likes. Nothing too burger crazy. Burger and beer, guys. That's all you need. Burgers <laughs> and beer. Nothing better at 9.05 a.m. Yeah. <laughs> right, a little mayo there. That's it. How many years have you been um, at the Craft Bash? Uh, this is my third year at the Craft Bash. Uh, so we've normally done tacos, but with my recent hit on me winning Guy Fieri Grocery Games, I did burgers on TV. Congratulations, by the way. Uh, we should you. have like led with that. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Uh, yes, yeah. please. So yes, tell us more. Burger episode. That's what everybody is kind of asking me, and everybody's requesting to eat burgers right now everywhere I go. Um, so we'll be serving burgers at the Craft Bash this year. And congratulations, Thank by you. the way. Oh, right? Really like, what has that. that done for you now? Like, it, right? It, yeah. It's yeah. a lot. I can't even keep up right now, but yeah. Did you get really, like a ton really of social followers like overnight? I did, yeah. My, I get notifications every time somebody goes to my website and my show has been airing like every few days. Yeah. And it's just like ding, ding, ding. It's like a hundred people on there. You know like, what that is? The sound of money. <laughs> that is, yeah. That's, that's what, what that I hope is. It. I hope the sound of money. Get yeah. out and try one of Ashley's burgers then. Come on out to the Craft, uh, craft Beer Festival happening again. Uh, the Kentucky Craft Bash this Saturday. The Times again? Uh, the VIP, uh, which is sold out, oh, is at noon. So you 1 can dream. PM. Yes. <laughs> but 1 p.m. for GA. Okay. Saturday, and June 24th. Tickets still available. You need to get Online, like, tickets yeah. to go to get that mm -hmm. again. Guys, thanks so much for bringing us this sample of yeah. everything, right? It's got a little taste. Now you got to go check it out in person. <laughs> Just go to kycraftbash.com.